Four minutes. Well, Facebook Profit. Really awesome Python and R library that basically allows you to see um, profit outlines, uh, the, well, pro sorry, profit statistical margins based off how much something is going on. Uh, Facebook is largely using it for website statistics so they can see like how many times has X been hit and what variables are, is that happening on? Now, the great thing about Facebook profit, unlike most of these data analytics things, is because it's based, because Facebook has a lot of money, they were able to figure out better ways on how to remove statistical outliers from their statistical data, which if you care about this stuff is like amazing. So finally you can remove Thanksgiving and your statistical models make sense. Um, yeah, it's, it's an amazing library. If you do anything with that analysis, you should download it because it's awesome. Um, it also will give you cool charts to see like what day did X happen? Um, I was playing around with it recently um, with the different, I, I think they're called altcoins, the different um, cryptocurrency variants, uh, looking at different things. I found one interesting static at, um, outlier, which is really fascinating to me because it also happens in regular stock market, but there's a reason it happens in regular stock market. I don't really understand why it's happening here is on Fridays, there's a huge sell-off of, of the certain altcoins, which makes the price go down. But then Monday morning, there's a huge buyback and makes the price go up. This actually happens in our traditional stock markets, but for some reason it's happening in the cryptocurrency world and I am so fascinated. I really want to understand why. Okay. Is there any questions about Facebook profits in my two minutes, I think, remaining? Yes, Chris. Yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> it's, 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 yeah. it's, it's logical that you'd have a hiatus yeah, but between the, Friday and Monday. But the problem is the hiatus is just so strange because the hiatus should be happening at random intervals. Because literally, and I don't, I don't mean to be rude to cryptocurrency people, but pajama wearing people in their basements, you know, they have no timetable. Like, <laughs> But drug dealers also work on the weekends. Like, yeah, yeah. this is this is literally taken three months of my life trying to figure out. I have thought of the variables. Ah, uh, but if, if my theory on well, the the, re, the most recent reason for Bitcoin to go up is if Chinese Chinese uh, real estate traders are trying to move money to to buy things. If their trades are not on are not on the weekend, that would that is possible, that would but affect things. The problem is, is that this has been going on in every cryptocurrency, not Bitcoin only. Like my original early things were whatever silly name and Bitcoin for cash, Bitcoin to cash, Bitcoin cash, Bit cash, Coin cash, that one, Bitcoin. I can't remember. Anyways, my original findings were based off those two, and they were both doing it, which I thought was weird. But then when I literally analyzed every cryptocurrency, every cryptocurrency, was it happened. So either there's some weird script somebody wrote to like do tradings, and then people are just following the thing, which, you know, um, Ackman's Ock, razor, that's the most likely solution. But it has to be something else. There has to be a sinister plot going on. Do I have any more time? Uh, three, two, one. Thank you, Miles. <laughs>